The Tampa Bay seafood industry has been hit really hard these days. Everybody from fishermen to chefs are waiting for some sort of return to normalcy. We're open to helping small local businesses navigate through this difficult time. ABC Action News reporter Sean Daly is in St. Pete now where these two industry vets are trying to boost the local fish business and also help you feed your family. Fish should swim three times, once in the sea, once in wine, and once in butter. Jason Gordon is the executive chef at the Big Catch at Salt Creek. Today, he's making grilled everything Caribbean red snapper, and he wants you to make it too. Fish this size, which is about one to two pounds, should be able to feed a family of four pretty easily. I think total today, I spent $26. To bring attention to Jason's restaurant, which is trying to survive on takeout, married couple and industry pros, Margaret and Rachel Cavello, are featuring his red snapper recipe on their local website, fishmongerapproved.com. The Tampa Bay seafood industry needs some love. Let's just say a month ago, there was, you couldn't find seafood. The prices were going through the roof because there wasn't enough available. They were shipping it all over the country, all over or, you know, the world basically our seafood was going to, to China, to Canada, everywhere. Now we've had a sudden stop. Local fish out of the Gulf of Mexico are very, very available, very affordable. And what we're trying to do right now is help the fishermen all the way down the supply chain to the guy that has the, the bait. We support the consumer, we support the seafood chefs, everybody, and the, and the eaters. So if you don't want to cook anything but you want to go out to eat, we'll send you to the right place. Okay, guys, for seafood recipes, for seafood videos, for all out seafood deliciousness. I can get you there on abcactionnews.com. Reporting from St. Petersburg, I'm Sean Daly, ABC Action News.